Good morning, I'm meteorologist Melissa Barrington. Well, many of you may be waking up to some flakes of snow outside. We have seen some scattered snow showers across the area. Not everybody is seeing it, but some kids might be kind of excited to see some snowfall out there on a Saturday. Uh, as we take a look here outside, we're taking a look at Greenville, and on the shot here, if you look closely, there are some snowflakes that are flying in the area, a lot of clouds. There are some peaks of sunshine out there, too. The biggest problem today, in addition to the snow showers, will be gusty winds. Winds later this afternoon could be as strong as 40 miles an hour. Here's a look at Live Doppler 2 HD, and you can see there's scattered areas of showers across the area. Most locations here are seeing it in the form of snow. Uh, so up around Greenville, there's some snow, possibly even a little bit of sleet just to the west of you in parts of Indiana there. We've seen some snow showers around Wilmington and also around Dayton. Uh, snow showers are working their way south and eastward as of this time. Not expected to accumulate to very much, but still kind of exciting for snowfall of the season. Here's a look at Live Doppler 2 HD in motion, and you can see here the blue working its way southeastward. Uh, we had a strong cold front move across the area during the overnight hours, and that has caused uh, much colder air to work its way through, and now we're seeing lake effect snow showers coming off of Lake Michigan. Your weather headlines for today, windy and much colder, very obvious, a mixture of rain and snow showers, and then for tomorrow, still cold and breezy, and we may start out Sunday morning with a couple of flurries as well. More sunshine, though, returns on Monday. As of 10.30 this morning, 36 degrees. The wind out of the west at 25 miles an hour. Pressure's at 30.08 inches. And here's a look at the numbers across the rest of the area. 38 is a pretty common number in Fairborn, Beaver Creek, Germantown. 34 in Kettering, 35 in Moraine. That's where we've actually seen that one band of snow move through, which is where it's a little bit cooler. And throughout the rest of the Midwest, temperatures have cooled down significantly compared to yesterday due to that front. 39 in Cleveland, 40 in Cincinnati, 37 in Indianapolis, and here at home it is 36. The wind though is going to be a major story this afternoon as winds could be as strong as 40 miles an hour. Right now though 25 miles an hour out of Dayton, same thing out of Indianapolis and also out of the Chicagoland area. Gusty winds throughout the Midwest and of course that is going to give us a wind chill for today. First time we're talking about that for this season. Uh, it feels like it's only 24 degrees outside so definitely chilly and if you haven't worn a coat like most of us haven't for the uh, most of the season so far, today's probably the day to pull it out. Satellite and radar together showing that that cold front moved through overnight and now we're left with lingering snow showers across the area. May encounter some slick spots on the roadways and of course people need to remember how to drive in snow showers and we haven't seen much rain either so we just need to take it a little bit easy on the roadways today. So today temperature is pretty much holding in the 30s. Top temperature at a maximum 40 degrees. Uh, windy and much colder with scattered rain and snow showers throughout the day. Then tonight 27 windy and cold and still some snow showers a possibility winds could gust as high as 30 miles an hour then tomorrow chilly again highs only in the upper 30s a morning flurry is possible afternoon sunshine working its way through your extended forecast though monday and tuesday look dry with highs in the mid 40s and then as we get closer to the thanksgiving holiday it looks like we're going to see another storm system come in wednesday and then finally exit out of the area on thanksgiving day